Hey everybody, it's Kivikom. The demo counter has returned. In this version of the game, it is off by default, so I've turned it on. I had to uh, correct the demo counter, but everything should be fine going forward. Let's go to the hub. So the first 10 minutes of this is going to be hub exploration and possibly cutscenes. Wow, the planet looks really nice and you can see the giant egg. And we got a leak for coming here. So that's seven leaks in total. Is a oh, why can't I go back in that room? Oh yeah, so like we can choose what world we can go to. We actually have a choice. So there's the world with the egg. There's forest world. And there's desert world. Will we do them in order? We'll be doing the, the, the forest world next. But first, let's explore the spaceship. Uh, let's let's start over here. Unlocks the one containing four... Unlocks upon it, obtaining four super leaks, but I can go in right now. Uh, okay. So, I should also say that apparently I'm playing an unstable version of this game and some things may be broken, so it's on my job to point them all out. Foba 555. Ties are in this season, eh? Well, I just, I literally bought two ties the other day. It's perfect. Geno World. I have listened to that song before. Oh. Yeah, how did you put them on in the first place? Well, if you need a hand, you can you can always ask. Storage room. I need three super leaks. Okay, I actually can't go into that room. That's that's good. Hello Moon. King1216. Mustache and hat combo. No one in the world has better fashion. Well you're not even in the world. You're a moon. I recognize this dude. Shaman. And we did it again. Yeah, he, Shaman was behind the first game and this game. What's this say? Couch gag room. Whoa. These are these are all these codes that are running the game. And this over here is a life farm. So I just stand here. And you can see that the amount of food up in the top corner is increasing. I don't have to do crazy work. I don't have to backtrack all the way through all the different worlds, like an A2MT, to jump on a shell uh, in a pool of water. We, uh, Demo, you look sort of weird in this uh, in here. You look sort of blotchy. I'm, I'm glad. Like, look at the difference. Demo's all sort of bloody in there, and it's okay out here. It's sort of strange. Uh, someone suggested that I update my Luna Lua version, but I can't. There's sort of restrictions with ASM VXT two. Why are you shooting a guy? Oh, it's Horikawa. That's not Horikawa. You are American. Oh, yes, you can have a gun. Uh, nice and easy if you're small. I'll keep that in mind. If you come across nice and easy to just slide if you're small. So we've done the couch gag room, aka the life farm room. Unlocks four super leaks. Can't go in there. Okay, what have you got to say? Radical video game time is radical. It's radicola. Okay, so I think we've explored everything we can explore except that one place that we're not supposed to be able to explore. So uh, let's go back to the transporter room and go to Forest World. So I'm suspecting that there will be a cutscene at the start of this, but that's okay. It looks very foresty and has one giant tree. No. Different versions of this game, the teleporters work in different ways. So is it a door? It's a door. It was a pipe, and I thought that made more sense. Forest world, yo. I also want to point out that you uh, can't go back to the hub until you beat the world, so you have that one chance to, to farm for lives. The preventable forest path. This is our introduction. This is a very pixelated background. Welcome to the welcome to Treehouse Carnival. Is that the name of this world? Don't worry, things things don't always make sense. You're right, Kalioka, you're right. Cotton candy is this way. So this must be the introduction level to the world. Just like we had uh Yeah, these aren't these aren't harmful. What have you got to say? Muffin Rides see the great crab. Not interested? Okay then. Okay. Nice try. The fishing fish guy doesn't exist in this engine. But that that's close enough. Or does he? I actually can't remember. The planet of preventable forests. That's the real name of this place. Why did we start in the carnival? Man, I have to get used to the physics again. This tree sure has a lot of branches. I'm sure getting hurt a lot. The extremely branchy branchy tree. Oh yeah, we have um 
When I get rid of this dancing guy, I'll do the music thing. Ah, uh, there's a firewalk coming after us. Right, let's music it up. I have to, you have to remind me. Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. I don't have a power up in reserve. I have a time stopping machine. Let's waste it. Oh, that music is so good. There's a crab. There's another dancing guy. We don't have to worry about him. Hi. Hello indeed. Are you an enemy? Probably. Is there a cutscene? There's a cutscene. Cheetah's on a Goopa. So, a forest this time, eh? I wonder where the Super League is. Probably hidden in a giant tree monster. Or maybe just a regular giant tree. Hmm, true. Put my money on inside a random hole somewhere. Don't you dare start jumping in holes or okay. <laughs> Please. Only one Super League on this planet. Okay. How do you know that? I don't know, I just did. Oh yeah, there, there's Space Masters of Space in this game. Super leaks. They sure are. Well, I know what's going on here. What? This is just like, yeah, this is exposition. Where you drone on and on about backstory and plot and stuff. Poor Kood. Nobody wants to hear about that junk Kood. Man, Demo, why are you being rude? Yeah, Kood, you should know better. For shame. Well, I didn't... <sighs> show some... Show of legs. Who cares about Kood's big expository dump? Man, poor Kood. Valuable information. Not to mention the big amnesia subplot. Oh, big emotional thing. Uh, da, 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 da. Whoa, a character just teleported in. That's Serac? Oh, Feed. No, Feed. No, Serac is a different one. Uh, I have information. There's no amnesia. That's going to happen at all. Steven? No, it's Feed. You got it all wrong. Uh, teleport from a different dimension. Don't do spoilers for the end of the game. See, it says Feed there. It's not. It's not. You're not Steven. And it has. Why does Feed have a big pillow thing? It's just alternate versions of yourself. Yeah, there's Koopas everywhere, dude. Iris has left the building. Does it really matter? I don't know. It just takes up video time. Sometimes we run left. Sometimes we jump. That is true. <laughs> yes, you are the only one who cares about what's going on. Yeah, Rocco's house exploded in the last game. That's unfortunate. I, you can pause, I am reading this. And everybody goes. So the game has made it clear that it doesn't care about cutscenes, but it's going to still show us cutscenes. Just Rusty, the first real level. Lemmings. <laughs> the music sort of gives away what we're doing here. Oh, man. Guide all the lemmings to the exit. If you get stuck, you can use a nuke to retry. A nuke is not a great way of retrying. Mushrooms are immune to the nukes. Okay, let's go. So, we have to get all the lemming dudes. Whoops, what's over here? Coins, a mushroom. We can pick them. Oh no, we can't pick these up. Okay, so what we have to do is place a mushroom sort of here. Whoops, yeah, that should do. So now they warp up. There you go, and there's a nuke thing up there that will reset the room. And they all go in the hole. Let's grab these coins over here real quick. Okay, did I win? I won! And we get a door. Next room! Ah. So the mushroom stops them from walking, and then we just spit them up there. I'm glad that the... Uh, yeah, these, uh, these poles are solid, so you have to use Yoshi's tongue. Hooray! What is this anyway? Oh, it's oh, it's just like a sky hole thing. It's like a a truck door. Okay, what's going on in here? Oh, this looks dangerous. I can oh, I can pick them up. I don't think that's how you're supposed to do it, but I think what you're actually supposed to do is use this very very loud gun to shoot them up the hill. Just 
just go up the hill. Yeah, to get him over the holes. Man, why, why won't you get shot up over the holes? Yeah, and it only seems to work if you're at a distance because... This is very silly. Now, I'm going to try to do at least one of them legit. That's it. Go, go up. Go up. Green-haired green man. Do it. I think that maybe you can pick them up just to make this a little easier. Oops, that's what he said. Let's not let's not throw them. Don't just Oh I see, okay. So with these guys I have to like press down to gently put them down. I can't just let go of the button slide them over. Don't stop picking up the cannon. I wanna pick up that green haired dude, the lemming. Now, everything is quiet. Where's my door? Oh, there's the door. Music has changed. This, I, uh, this music is great. Okay, so this time we're going to have to clear the way. And we can't pick them up anymore. I don't want to commentate, I just want to listen to the music. Demo, you have to... I know so see is the pillar over there. Okay, we have walking bombs. That's real handy, because you can just place them down. You're, you're not in the wrong place. You're not in the wrong place. You're not in the right place, dude. So I need a new bomb. I'm going to accidentally hit the nuke at some point, just saying. Man, ah, man, I don't want to die here. Just put the bomb down. There we go. And uh, now I just uh, stand over here. Where's that guy go? Oh, I thought that guy was walking off screen over on the left. I have to wait for this one dude. Hurry up. And I think the door is behind the pillar. I stand on the pillar and hope nothing bad happens. There we go. Oh, I had that's... What? What do I have to do? Oh, I have to collect all the coins, probably. Or... Yeah, let's reset the room. Okay, collect all the coins might make a bridge spawn. Hurry up, hurry up. Why do you have loads of time? There we go. Now we just wait for them to... I'm glad you give us a bit of let, but that's a lot of let. Why is there oil on the floor? That looks like a trap from the Home Alone game for the Sega. Where you can place oil on the floor and Marv and the other guy get stuck in it. Um, I think we're getting a new door each time. I think this is a Yumi Niki door. Right, what are we going to do in here? Okay, we have to dig in the sand. Hill wharf up there. Set that up. Oh, I see. And there's probably another mushroom. So what I'm going to do is dig through the sand because we're playing Super Mario Bros. 2. Get the other mushroom ready. Place that here. Put this. Pick this up. And we've won the game. Let's put that down here. Where's the door going to appear, by the way? Yeah, you go all... You fall down the hole. I don't know how this works, by the way. Hooray! And that was that level. Like, I... I it's a level that did... Like, I like the idea of introducing new gimmicks. I think, I think that's great. What's the next one? Omelette Jungle. Oh, I remember this level. I even remember the music. Who wrote it? It's Mandu. Are you... Is that a talk house guy? Or is... I don't know. Yeah, so this level... Hi, Bat. This level is all about those uh, egg things up above. Which host enemies. So we're going to get sabotaged. Go away, Bat. What are you? Well, you're just furbas so far. I'm not so worried. I'm more worried about the red caterpillar things. I think they're different from the green caterpillar things. Oh no, we have to survive in here or something. What's this? I actually want to... I want to pick this up. Can I pick it up? Yes, I can. What's in it? Oh, health. Okay, so this is just... Survive until the correct egg smashes. Teeth, you're sort of in the way. Come over here. Like, I'm afraid to do... 
food. Well, we're going to use this. Uh, and then we're going to hit this. There we go. Whoops. Why did I stand in the place of the egg? Do I want to switch to food? Well, uh, coup time, I guess. Yeah, I feel bad for Kud. Because, you know, he, he, he wants to have a more story-driven video game. Okay, Guardian of the Forest, what have you got to say? How about a shell game? Follow me with your eyes. Okay. Uh, I actually didn't pay attention to the first one right here. Winner! I get a three up. A uh, thing and a clock. That is absolutely useless. Can I still finish the level with the clock going? Well, I can go under the level. Okay, that's fine. Why did we have to switch the coup for the end? I didn't get a life. I was really high up. Thanks. Thank you for sending us off, uh, horn thing. Oh, we have time for one more level. Oh, it's two exits. Koopa time? Well, I don't want to play with the Koopa in Koopa time. No, I don't want that. Uh-oh. Okay, we are cooed. We're forced to be cooed again. Hey there, Agent Cooed. Go kill all the bad guys, okay? What do you mean I'm a bad guy? That's crazy. I'll give you this power for free to show you what a swell guy I am. Now go jump in a hole or something. Right, let's music it up. And then we're going to do this action pack level. Koopa Bros squared. Ciao, guy. A squared. I don't think we have to actually kill all the enemies in this level. But I may try. What is this? It's like a giant meatball. Like they're The gimmick in this game is that the things in the ground aren't vegetables, but they're they're meat. Whoa, game don't like. Smevex has some computational problems occasionally. What's in here? It's a fish, see? It's all meat based stuff. Go over here. What's in here? Nothing. Coins generally aren't worth it. Well, I'm down to one health. Oh, do you know I'm going to backtrack real quick? Oh, did I click the health that Bowser gave me? Oh, it's just... I don't want to play as Kood here. I want to have the ability to spin jump. What's in here? Have some steak. Oh yeah, you fall off platforms. I remember how you were. Also, platforming is actually generally... Tricky with food. Because of the way I play, where I keep on I press the jump button and then re-hold it after pressing it because I'm a weirdo. Oh yeah, multi-kill. Yeah, okay, can we go in this I don't know if we can go in this part. Oh I wanna Don't get hit. Don't get hit. Your swimming is real awkward, Kood. Okay, just keep on going up, keep on going up. Hide in your shell! I saw a power up down below. Two. Damn it. Thank you very much. Don't know if you've noticed by now, but these sound effects are from uh, from Spyro the Dragon. Uh, okay. Oh, you're a power up. That I need very badly. Thank you very much. Alright. Whoa. Uh, a twomp with multiple layers of animation. Well, why are there different twomps in this game? Uh, I wish I could spin jump because I kind of want to... I think I can jump up top there. Yes, I can. I don't want to go down below because that's slightly tricky. Can you kill Twombs? Yes, you can. Okay, here's a Kood jump. That's the only reason we're playing as Kood. There's that one awkward jump that only he can do. I'm pretty sure Demo could do it, actually, and Iris. But fall in the hole. This is an opportunity to use the spin jump button that automatically makes you glide. Yeah, have what? Why? Uh, giant onion things, whatever they are, are not meat. Why are they buried in the ground? That makes no sense. Game, you're inconsistent. Oh, hey, midpoint. We have a long level. Man, I just want to bounce off a dude and have to rehold the, the jump button, but. Whatever. Oh, wait, the midpoint didn't reheal me? What a chip. What's up here? Yeah, you're gonna help me get through the wall. What's in this door? Slightly different music. From Super Smash Brothers. I have no familiarity with Super Smash Brothers. I've never played it nor seen a game of it. 
All right, that's a lot of power-ups. Should I be scared? Does this level have... Does this level have two exits? Just has two exits. Okay. Uh, do you know what? No, give me another one. Give me another dude. World's slowest cannons. Thanks. There we go. This place looks considerably more dangerous, so it looks like we have to go up top and backtrack again or something. We're stuck down. We're safe. Okay, that guy respects proximity. I don't know if we'll have build generators in this game. Respect proximity? Yeah! It's, it didn't just say yay, it said yeah. Okay. Don't you dare, bullet bonsai, bonsai bill, don't you dare. I'm not sure. I, I'm trying to work out the best way of using Kud in these sort of places. Because I think this spin jump ability would be real useful if I could use it correctly. My spin jump, I mean, what the spin jump button does. Right, let's save, save this here. Oh no, it's a left too. Well, I'm gonna hold in this P-switch. I know that was supposed to be for a different level. Stop throwing bombs. Oh, you're gonna blow up that guy. Do you know what? Throw bombs at my enemies. I'm fine with that. Uh, this is a level where playing it slightly slow and carefully seems to be working out real well. Whoops. Didn't see that bat. Didn't, I almost didn't see that bat too. Bats are tricky. I'm glad the bombs don't explode when they land beside me. Oh, there's another P-switch. Okay, the P-switches are actually to make all this a little bit easier. How did I dodge all those things? Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Lakitu, can I destroy Lakitu with this? No, okay. Damn it. My experiment caused me pain. Just keep on flying. Just, oh man, there's so much stuff going on. Just... Uh, I think Black 2 is actually friendly. Oh, hey, if I keep a... Well, I don't need to, but I... Let's, let's get the equivalent of the moon. Yeah, there you go. Through the door. Wow, I... I did pretty well in that room, and we're inside a big clown mouth face thing. Okay, what did we unlock? Oh, we unlocked a pipe. Let's go back. I'm... T World 2, my demo counter is 5. That's... I hope it's supposed to be five. So what what happened was the demo counter remembered like it counted all the demos from the test recordings I did too and it said that I died 20 times which is wrong. Um so I had to like I deleted the demo file, the original demo counter file and had to re-die in this game in the appropriate levels. Like that's that's what I did before this recording session. Oh, and for those of you who want to know, who are want to download this game and don't have access to the demo counter, if you literally type in the word, like all one word, toggle demo counter, that's what turns it on. And presumably off again. This fireball is going to do your chicken dance, dude. This fireball is going to make uh, this a bit easy. I already got you, Route Coin. Yeah, listen to the drum solo. Oh, don't get hit. I seem to be um, much better at this engine than uh, at the Super Mario World engine. Maybe I should be playing Super Mario Bros. 3 ROM hacks. Go away. Oh, don't up, 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 up. I pressed the wrong button. Just after I talked about how I'm better. I, why, why did I press the run button to all things to like... I don't know, I'm just done. Oh man, I'm gonna have to edit this video. Probably. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe it'll be short enough that I don't have to edit. So like, I want all the videos in this series to be 720p and 60 frames a second, because I record everything in 60 frames a second. Uh, but, uh, but, I have problems doing that. So, DxTory, like, if the recording files can't be read properly by um, by Adobe Premiere, it sort of produces garbage. Like, every time I collect a power-up, there'd be, like, garbage on screen. Although, but, you know, other editing programs don't have that issue. 
And Windows Movie Maker can make things in 60 frames a second, but if I do basically any editing, especially if I do any sped up sections, uh, it crashes when it's editing the 60 frames a second file. Like when it's processing it, it's sort of hard to explain. Ah, oh, it's so dumb. Like That's why when things are 60 FPS or not, it's real inconsistent. Whoa, like there are some high def jump videos out there in the middle. Just go over this uh, Venus flytrap kind of dude. Okay, we're nearly back to the midpoint, I think. I don't I don't think any of these are power-ups. Nope. I know I haven't tried to win in any pipes, but I just vaguely remember not having to go in any pipes in this level. Okay, now we're going to have to deal with this dude. Why doesn't the midpoint bar heal me? By deal with this dude, I mean throw a shell at him. Oh yeah. Right, so what have we got in the second half? Okay, let's go get ourselves that coin because I didn't collect it last time. And I also want to travel down below. Damn it, I missed. Thank you. Why did Bowser want us to kill all the dudes anyway? Oh yeah, because we're a Koopa. <laughs> like, it makes total sense. He thinks we're a regular old Koopa. Why do saws affect enemies in this game? Well, anyway, let's keep on going. And I'm, go I'm, now going I'm now doubting myself. Do they affect enemies in Super Mario World? I don't think so. Uh-oh. I should not have done that. Why am I cooed? Oh yeah, because the story of this level is that Bowser sends one of his Koopas to do work. I'm forgetful. I was only just saying this. There we go. Well, now I have to get the awkward power up. So awkward. Throw it. Good job. So I'm glad that this this game actually has like a good difficulty curve. Like this is actually a reasonable level for a new player to do in World Two. Unlike in Jump, where you'll be doing effort land right now, basically. Uh, right, so let's actually stay still and watch things. I'm trying to scroll the screen here, but it ain't working. Oh, that worked. That didn't work as I thought it would, but okay. Yeah, you have my hands. Yeah, who needs fireballs when you can throw meatballs? Oh, I need fireballs. By the way, those, those trolleys do hurt you if you stand... If you get hit by the side of them. Why would I want to go down below here? I don't know. Throw, throw that steak. You didn't throw it right. Um, I want to go down here. Oh, it looks like there's another secret on the other side. Okay. What am I going to do with you? Because this is like a big earthquake making explodey block. Yeah, I think this is like a secret zone. Yeah, there's all friendly dudes down here. What have you got to say? I'm a guy. Why does uh, everyone keep asking me that? Okay, dude. Well, guy, I found a somewhat obvious secret. Are you not just a cat's meow? Why did I do that? Why did... Throw a fireball. I can't throw a fireball while holding an object. There we go. Burn it. Burn it. There we go. Why doesn't it turn into a coin when you burn it? I don't know. Wow, even fireballs don't don't disappear. I'm going to leave you there. I don't think they despawn. But let's find out, actually. What's in here? Nothing. Any secrets? No, nothing. So I don't think... Uh, yeah, so that fireball is just going back and forth for infinity. Okay, I think, think power-ups don't despawn. I think I can come back and collect that if I want. So that was a secret with coins. Man, my voice is breaking today like you wouldn't believe. Fall. Damn it. Well, I'm glad I left the fireball. I'm glad I don't despawn. More confirmed than before. Okay, no fire, fire, fire. Now, this is going to be a long video, but I'm going to leave a link in the description to, like, skip the cutscene stuff at the start. Because I know not everybody's interested in that. Like, that was one of the main complaints about this game. Uh-oh. 
If I said I own, it was like the easiest thing in the world. Alright, let's... Fireballs make this overpowered. Like, why Why does... Why is Koo the only Koopa who gets fireball abilities? Well, I know the Elite Koopas in Super Mario World Central Production have them, but then... Um, ah! I think I found all the coins, but I got them all at different times. Two deaths in a level. I'm getting terrible at games. Okay, so next time on A2XT, it's either Plant Zone or the Secret Route. I might actually take the Secret Route next time. Warping your way to victory, I'm taking the Secret Route next time. Talk to you all then.